In Rwanda, people living in the rural areas are usually very poor and do not have access to eyeglasses. At a population of 11.4 million inhabitants, there are currently only 11 ophthalmologists. One Dollar Glasses Germany started a pilot project in Rwanda and trained a team to test and locally produce cheap glasses. The one dollar glasses are manufactured on bending and milling machines. The frames are made of a lightweight and flexible material, made of extremely robust, rust-proof and hypoallergenic spring steel wire. The frames are manufactured by hand. The lenses can easily be inserted and tightly fastened in the frames. The two colored glass pearls give each pair of one dollar glasses its own personal design. The glasses are lightweight and do not require nose bridges. This attractive design gives people the confidence to wear the glasses in public. Dans notre atelier de Wandora Glass, nous fabriquons des lunettes. Nous sommes au nombre de 18 personnes et nous nous travaillons beaucoup depuis le mois de février. Nous avons fabriqué à peu près 3000 lunettes. The machines can easily be operated by solar power. Manufacturing is easy. It doesn't need to be highly skilled. Two weeks are enough to train someone and we may manufacture them. The lenses, they are plastic in nature. They cannot break even if you throw them down. Before giving out the glass, you also test pupil distance. After testing, you can immediately get your glasses. <laughs> Ali Ahmed Bulegea Ndaisaba from One Dollar Glasses, Rwanda, conducts a follow-up meeting with some of the recent users to find out how their new glasses have changed their lives. This elderly man from Musambira town explains how for the first time in his life he's able to see clearly and properly use his cell phone. The population here will very appreciating this project because of its importance to help them improving their life. Many of them are poor. If they cannot afford the price of testing, they cannot afford the, the price of buying a pair of glasses. Our plan is to satisfy the market and to extend the market to our East African community and later to the whole Africa and maybe the, the product being implemented in the worldwide.